right guys so i just wanted to do a quick little video just to um show you guys my little setup of my lash station and equipment um these are some of the items that i use when i am um preparing for my client so first things first you want to make sure you got your acetone um i usually dip my tweezers in here right before my client and then i have this um citrus 2 hospital germicidal deodorizing cleaner i clean my tweezers with that um as well before every client so i use my acetone i dip the tweezers in here and then i clean them with this so i bought these on amazon i think they came in like a pack of three so yep and then i also have my sanitizer i like to sanitize my hands during the process before the process and after the process make sure you have paper towels handy because you know some people's eyes get watery um so you don't want to be wiping your tears with your hand or having the clients wipe it you want to make sure you have paper towels so that you can wipe you know wipe any excess water away from their eyes when you're lashing um, this is a little nano mister i don't really use this um because i did purchase ruthie bell super bonder and with this uh you don't have to use the nano mister because once you apply this it Im immediately cures the glue and you shouldn't have to use a, a nano mister so um that's that um always carry some eye drops just in case you never know you might have clients that might have somewhere to go right after so you don't want them leaving with red eyes if their eyes are red so you want to keep you want to keep this around so that you know they can apply to their eye before they leave i have my stacy lash lash shampoo which i'm currently using but i will be making my own bottles of lash cleanser which i will be using on my clients and i'll also be selling as well so if the clients want to purchase some to go home they'll be able to do that right now i'm using stacy lash extra strong evolution glue this is my glue aid from lashbox la which i use on the lashes i put some on the strip you guys should know about that already i already made a video about those items but these are the items that i use i also have this which is a vitamin e oil um it's a skin oil that i use up under their eyes once i take the tape off i put a little bit under there so that it doesn't irritate their skin um i also put it above their eyelid um where the tape was as well um so you know they don't have that little white look afterwards and also it helps to help the skin from drying so this is basically that everything that i'm that, that i have for my setup this is my my drawer i have it i have this um and a few other items listed in the description box and where to purchase it you want to make sure that you have this to store your lashes in and store your supplies in this is how it looks it's a tin drawer organizer i have quite a few things in here i have my lashes and everything in here my tape my mirror you want to have your little um oops what is this this is my thermometer i don't really use it anymore since i've been using the glue a but some people still use it and for newbies i would suggest you know to use it you know at the beginning once you get comfortable and you you know you know what you're doing then you won't have to use it. I have my brushes. Where's my little fan? Um, I keep a mirror here so that the clients can take a look at their lashes once we're done. All right. But I also have my portable fan, which I use a lot for the clients to dry their lashes with. I also have this fan as well just in case it dies and i can just plug this in and have them dry their lashes as well i will do another detailed video with um how everything is set up so that you guys can take a look 
you guys have questions about any of the products that I do use like I said before um, in the description box I did list quite a few items that you can purchase on Amazon uh, to start up your business and I will do another video on that as well but as you can see my ring light and then all the little items that I use when my clients first come in so I hope this video was helpful <laughs> say hi Santana hi yeah he won't let me do anything but all right see you guys in the next video